everyone that time once again for another Final Cut Discovery Edition. Got a few of those for you to help you kind of decide what to get for that film lover amongst your family and friends. And so today we're going to look at the Ultra HD 4K release of uh, the Don't Worry Darling film that came out this past year. A very divisive film. Some folks thought it was eh, others hated it, some enjoyed it, but all found the behind the scenes drama that came with it far more entertaining than the movie itself. Now, uh, you can check out my movie minute to uh, see what I thought of this film. I thought it was okay. Uh, I did have a few uh, problems with the decisions they made in the script, but then there's always Florence Pugh, so can't go wrong there. As far as uh, this disc release, let's see uh, if you can go, can't go wrong with picking this one up. So here we have the uh, Don't Worry Darling uh, 4K Ultra HD, as I mentioned. Now, this combo pack is going to go for uh, $39.98. You can just get the Blu-ray pack for $34.98. And if you're still rocking that DVD, you can get it for $29.98. So you have a number of different options there. As far as the case and the release goes, nothing too inspired here. We don't get a sleeve uh, like we did with the others. We literally just have the case itself with the basic movie poster on the front there with the don't worry darling the credits and uh listing the three items you get with this combo pack which is including the digital code which is good for about two years uh the spine is a basic spine as well and on the back we have on here uh, the summary as well as the credits and how to get as always that 4k ultra hd experience as well as the extras that are listed here uh not many as far as the physical copies on the inside well uh we're looking at here uh two different colors which i'm glad they did i'm very happy that they chose to distinguish between uh the two discs we have uh, the uh, blu-ray here which is in the pink and in the black is the ultra hd uh 4k disc and of course we have our digital code here which uh, again, you can use on movies anywhere. So yeah, glad they went with the different colors there. I like that quite a bit. And the discs, uh, the paint and artwork on there uh, looks pretty sharp as well. Now, as far as that fun interactive menu goes, let's take a look at that, uh, shall we? Now here we have the interactive menu, and yes, you have uh, your uh, obviously your scene selection there. Our, we have our basic template here for uh, the menu, as uh, well as your audio choices and your subtitle choices, and then there's the special features. Um, <laughs> two of them. Two special features that we get in here. A 17 minute featurette of the making of Don't Worry Darling and a cut scene called Alice's Nightmare. It's a deleted scene. That one's not even like a minute long. As far as the behind the scenes featurette goes, it's probably one of the better featurettes I've seen come out of uh, the discs that we have reviewed here from Warner Brothers Home Entertainment. Not only does it give you some insight in their motivation and how they were approaching this film, it gives you uh, maybe a different perspective of what the relationship amongst the cast and crew are or were i should say um you know it has that reputation of being controversial and everybody hating one another and all kinds of fights and that but everybody puts their best face forward in the behind the scenes and you feel this energy come through it and they clip along nicely they don't reuse shots at all like we've seen in some featurettes and uh, they really give you some really cool info on how they thought about capturing that 50s style with the location shoots the uh, choices the uh, um, uh, costuming and all of that and what's really cool is while uh, they're talking about them they'll show a scene and they'll have in the corner either right or left where that scene and when they shot uh, that series of scenes so that's also very interesting if you're into the behind the scenes stuff so yeah uh, 17 minutes that's packed full of some information that i found actually quite entertaining i also found alice's nightmare a very creepy cutscene that i kind of wish they would have put in there or kept in there but i understand why they cut it but it was a very disturbing a kind of uh trent reznor ish uh type of feel uh to a like the girl with the dragon tattoo type of opening <laughs> kind of that feel to it really uh 
So, yeah, I mean, don't worry, darling. Uh, if you are a fan of this film and are looking to get it for yourself, or if you know of a fan of the movie, you may want to get this, not only because you have the Blu-ray and digital copy, but in case that person does ever decide to upgrade their 4K, uh, they already have it here in the combo pack. So I uh, hope it wet your whistle and uh, maybe I piqued your interest a bit in getting this. Also, uh, check out our Patreon if you haven't already. And at bells and whistles and subscribe here onto YouTube. I thank you so much for your support. Until next time, remember, keep that ticket stub.